Hello and welcome to the tutorial on Find the Missing Number. In this tutorial, we will learn how to find the missing number for number bonds to 1000. And we're going to be looking at subtraction questions. So let's have a look at our first example. We have 1000 minus something equals 546. 1000 minus something equals 546. Now in previous tutorials, what we did was we moved the missing number and we swapped it with the number on the right. And then we, then we would subtract 546 from 1000. We're not going to do that in this tutorial. What we're going to do is we are going to, let me just change colors, add numbers to the 546 until it equals 1000. Okay, so let's begin. We're going to start with the units. We've got six units. We have to make it equal to zero and we are adding. So what number added to six is going to give us a zero? The answer is four. Let's add this together. We've got six plus four is 10, zero. We're going to carry one. Four plus one is five and the hundreds doesn't change. Okay, on to the tens. We've got five tens. We need to make it equal to a zero. So what number added to five is going to give us a zero? The answer is five. Five plus five is 10. The units doesn't change. Okay, let's add these together. Zero plus zero is zero. Five plus five is 10. Got a zero here and we're gonna carry one. And for the hundreds, five plus one is six. So we are now up to 600. Now have a look at the hundreds. We've got six over here. We need to get to, let's combine these, we need to get to 10. What number added to six will give us 10? The answer is four. Let's add these together. And we've got zero, zero, and six plus four is 10. Now that was our target. We had to get to 1000. Now what numbers have we added to get to 1000? They're all in pink. We've got 4 and 50 and 400. Now we're not adding these, we're simply collating each of the digits. We've got 400 and 54. Okay, so we're not doing uh, addition again. It's simply 454. That is the answer. 1000 minus 454 equals 546. The missing number was 454. Okay, we're going to look at a second example. This time, I'm going to do this rather quickly. And there is a reason for that. Let me just write the question down. We've got 1000 minus something equals 724. So the same principles as above, and I'm going to go through this quickly, okay? Units, we've got four, four plus six is 10. Okay, I'm gonna carry one over. Onto the tens, we don't have two tens, we've actually got two plus one, it's three. Three plus seven equals 10. Okay, we're going to carry another one over. Hundreds, seven plus one is eight. How many do we need to get to? Well, we need to get to 10. The answer is two. That's our answer, 276. So 1000 minus 276 equals 724. The missing number was 276. Now, the reason why I went through the second example quickly was to show you that all of the workings out in the first one, you can actually do in your head. You can go straight from the question and straight to the answer, as in example B. Okay, the workings is me showing you the process step by step. So that is how we find the missing number for number bonds to 1000 with subtraction questions.